Alright guys, so today I'm going to show you how to install Morrowind on Linux. It's super simple and it, you know, it runs seamlessly because it uses the OpenMW engine, which isn't the official engine of Morrowind, but what it is, is it's a re-implementation of it. And they use this engine on Windows and everything because you know it's better, it's less buggy, all that sort of stuff. But one upside of it is you can also saw Morrowind on Linux and Mac OS now. So I'll just show you how to do that. I'll do it on Manjaro and of course to play Morrowind you need Morrowind. So you gotta get Morrowind from somewhere. I'll be honest with you guys, I just downloaded it off the internet archive. It will, because you're not actually running the Morrowind engine you download, you're running OpenMW, it can you know it can be a real dodgy sort of thing. So all you need is you need wine and you also need OpenMW of course. So I'm gonna to go to where I downloaded the Morrowind and I just got this ISO here. So basically it you know that's what you get on the disk. So I'm gonna mount this this ISO here. I'm going to mount it somewhere. Oh, it's already mounted. Alright. So you go to the mount directory. And you know, you got, you got the setup.exe there. But we're, we're going to run that with Wine. And then we're going to use OpenMW to run that installation. So we got to config Wine first. Wine config you know you just need to use the regular settings or nothing special all right so you just installed one just normal settings nothing nothing out of the ordinary so we'll go to where we mounted um where we mounted where we mounted Morrowind you know if you bought it off Steam or good old games or whatever you'll just run the install and then skip to open MW part but we'll with wine we'll run the setup.exe and see you know you don't need the original .exe because basically what open MW does is just uses the assets and all that sort of stuff I might create it. So we finish installing that. And all we do now is we run OpenMW Launcher and we'll run the installation wizard. Because we, we already in, installed it with WAN, we'll just use the existing installation. If, you know, if you downloaded it legit, then this is the same sort of way. Sometimes it'll auto detect where it is, but not always. So just go to Wine, Drive C, Program Files, L Scrolls, and you're just looking for any SM file. See, so super simple. See what am I getting? Like 40, you know, 60 frames per second. Of course, I'm recording at the moment, so it's down a bit. I usually get stable 60 frames per second. So, yeah, this, this video is for all you guys. Let's say there's no games on Linux. There is. You just gotta play them. You just gotta play 20 year old games. So, yeah, whatever. I'll see you guys later.